Ghana started piloting the malaria vaccine in 42 districts of seven regions in the country. Currently, over 400,000 children are said to have received the vaccine in the first phase. The second phase is expected to commence in December. We are currently here at Germany in the South Dai district of the Volta region, where we want to find out the impact of the vaccine on children in this community. Ghana will be expanding the rollout to additional 91 districts in the Ahafo, Bono, Bono East, Central, Uti, Upper East and Volta regions. Over 1.3 million doses were administered. For babies in the first 18 months, four doses of the vaccine are required. This is a coastline community whose main source of livelihood is fishing. Healthcare workers are stationed at the markets to serve mothers whose wards are due for immunization. But the low numbers compelled the nurses to move into the community. Nine months old Dennis has just taken his second dose, which should have been his third, but Dennis had defaulted. It's important to give our babies the doses. All the households the nurses visited had children whose parents had defaulted in their dates of receiving the vaccine. My one is six months, seven months. I can't nine months, two months, two months, me and one. I am not happy I couldn't follow the routine, but I will try and finish it. And I can't, two years, then I'm a one. Before the vaccine came, my children were falling sick from malaria. Some families have a phobia for vaccines. My younger sibling had an issue after taking a vaccine some years ago, so my father has forbidden us from taking the vaccine. Two-year-old Samantha is the only child we met who had taken all four doses at their right times. At the Peking Government Hospital, this is where six-month-old Judy has been on admission for four days at the time the news team visited. She's not alone. Close to 80% of the children on admission here are battling malaria. The chances of most of them recovering quickly is however high as they have received some doses of the vaccine. Malaria cases in children under five years across the district reduced to 730 by mid-2022 from 999 recorded last year. EPI manager of the malaria vaccine rollout in the district says coverage is encouraging. Generally, when you look at it, you will see it has reduced malaria cases drastically among uh, children who are receiving the vaccination. However, because we have influx of other children from other non-implementing districts that visit our health facilities for uh, care, you are unable to really tell how the impact is when you look at the general population of children who are going down with the disease. But uh, critically looking at the data, there have been some impact. Sin has no doubt become the game changer in child health in the country. This is because parents have attested to the difference in the health care of their children before and after taking the vaccine. However, one major challenge is the lack of time to ensure the children get the appropriate dosages at the right time. Sarah Apenkro, TV3 News, Germany, South Dai District, Volta Region.